Hi, everybody. Welcome back hey. to Game Guys. Hey. <laughs> Season five. Season My dad five. does not know how to start a season in Game Guys. <laughs> and we're off. Right, here right. we go. So we're, we're in season five. We have officially beaten the base game of Elden Ring. And now we are... Together, we did. Together, yep. And now we are moving on to Shadows of the Earth Tree. DLC. Yes. Run so DLC. We're going to start off by leveling with the runes we got from the final boss fight of the base game. Dad, Plus a couple on. of millennia beats. I am I am summoning now, and I'm going to actually post when I'm going to be there. I'm going to be there on Saturday. Right, go um, ahead and level up, Dad. Just pr press A to level. Um, okay, so what are we leveling up? We are going to level up. We've only got, it looks like, we don't, we might, no, we don't have, we don't have four. I'll barely have four, so we, we can do four, and we'll have to eat runes. We're literally like like 320 right, runes away from four. Go ahead and put two points into endurance. All right. We're at 35 endurance. That's right. 35, right? Yes. Cool. Now, one point in dex and then one point in arcane. Okay, and I will not have enough for the arcane. All right, that's fine. But going forward, we're going to go dex, arcane, dex, arcane. Okay, okay, yep. okay, they're even right now. Okay, yep. No, canceling level up, is that okay? No, 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 no. Yeah, no, press oh. A, you're supposed to confirm. Yeah, press A. Yes. yes. Okay, so, but I still have 146,000. I, I mean, I could probably eat a couple of runes that I have because I'm, I'm collecting the rune arcs, you know? When I, when well, I rune beat, arcs when don't I beat give you runes, they just unlock the great rune passives. Well, I know when I beat Melania, I get like over a hundred thousand runes. When I boot, when I get when I go in with a host and I beat Melania, I get like over a hundred thousand runes. Nice. Well, if that's you're gonna why back when, out, we, when, we beat, when we beat when we beat when we beat. Hey, Dad, back uh, out while we're talking. You can burn runes to gain runes from your inventory. You just want enough for the next for the next up up right? Yes. You, or do you want me to eat? You don't want just me to eat, eat all, all of them. them. Yeah, just eat all of them. All of them right now. Yeah. Okay. All right. I forgot what I was talking about, um, but that's probably good. Oh, shit. That's probably good because... You were talking about... Yeah, we probably don't want me to be talking here. Uh, use... You were eat Yeah, you were, you were fighting Melania. By the, uh, yeah, so I get 100... Oh, yeah, yeah. So I get, you get 100,000. So, you can okay, keep so going, the rune... Keep, go. And and I, that's why. That's why you should talk because I'm. Okay. I can't. But Dad, I thought you could talk and multitask doing technical things at the same time. Robin, what, Robin, do I don't 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 take me back to the to the late '80s and make you remind me make me remind you what I was doing back then. Was he? What was he doing? Was he? Was he? Was he running? Was he running black market things? No, he was he was going to school at an Ivy League. Ugh. You selected number. Right. Okay, I'm, I'm getting, I'm getting the muscle memory down here. So, uh, my plan. So while Dad burns these runes, I'm gonna go ahead and sort of explain the rough plan for how we're gonna tackle the Shadow Realm. Okay. Now, the big mechanic I should that we all need to be aware of is that when you enter the Shadow Realm, the scaling changes. So your all-powerful endgame instant win build is going to actually be challenged in the Shadow Realm. However, okay, so don't go in there like I'm like I'm big shit. Like I I like pretend it's like I'm at the beginning of a game. Yeah, okay. Somewhat. Because yeah. I don't I don't do but see I don't do I don't do plus ones and all of that stuff. So I I don't know going into a DLC and just monstering through everything and, and all that Inventory. stuff. So. Yeah, I, I know I that you got me talking. That's the problem. I can't multitask. Really? Because when I try to multitask, never mind. <laughs> See, you, you distracted me. I know. I bust your. I actually can multitask. I just can't. I just can't think and talk at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. Are you? Hero's rune. I I win these when I when I beat when I beat Melania, yes. don't I? I? I don't know. So just... I so I get the so I get cash and prizes. 
Just use it. 30,000! Very excellent, Dad. But why don't they just group them all together? Why do I have to go to each of them? Because they're... Well, because then you have a... Con it's, it's just the way it's laid out. That would be cool if there was an option to consume all runes. That'd be a nice uh, quality of feature. Okay. But most gamers usually just tactically consume only the ones they need. All right, now we level up. All right, so we want to go down to Arcane. Arcane and then back to Dex. And then back to Dex, all right. Now press A. Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay, back out. And now we're going to actually enter the Shadow Realm. All right. Mikola has been a naughty chap, and we need to put a stop to him. That we can just go. We, we don't have to take the elevator menu. I thought we were going to do a big grand entrance. Well, I you're just. No, well, there's NPCs. You're no fun. It. I, I didn't then why did we do all that shit here? Then why did we do. I, because there's NPCs that show up. I don't want to. Let's. All right, now we get to talk to the NPCs. Sorry, I didn't mean to get all, like, trust fundy there, but... Can I... I'm not a trust... We're too poor uh, for me to be a trust fund kid. I was just behaving like one for a minute. I am Leda. And touch the withered arm. And you too will be transported to the realm of shadow where make my compatriots are there already. Like us... I, I, am I supposed to... You want me to get through this, right? All. If you can find them, they are certain to lend you aid. I figured you oh, were not... enjoying the dialogue. All right now, Dad. I, I want I want to set the, up the situation touch here. The arm and uh, okay, sorry. I... To the realm of shadow. I will Before you be touch anything behind. else, I do want to kind of do a little bit of a preface about the lore behind the Shadow Realm, or at least the bits. It's like it's like in school when they would check your hands after you came in from the playground. Oh. They oh never God. did that when I was in elementary school. No, they did different things to you. Uh, what do you, what did, did your, your okay. we're, we're filling time here, buddy. Yep, I know. I, uh, you were doing a hand gesture thing. I just wanted to make sure. Robin, get on with the lore. All right, so, uh, we have fought almost all of the demigods in the base game. Save one, Mikola. Now, Notice when you fight Melania, her full title is Melania, Blade of Mikola. That's because Melania is the older sister of Mikola, and she's essentially his consort, protector, provider. Here's the thing about Mikola. Mikola is forever cursed to be a 10-year-old boy, essentially. But he has the ability to charm anyone to be under his whimsical influence. He can essentially get a group of people who just want to murder each other to work together for a greater cause. But the problem is, he does this against people's will. So, let's just say the people that are, the, the, the Crusaders you're about to meet up with, they should not be getting along right now. But Mikola is forcing them to get along. And he's doing some shenanigans in the Shadow Realm, and maybe we should check that out. As as the newly appointed Elden Lord of the Lands Between is our responsibility to... to fix the remainder of the bullshit that the demigods did. There's a lot of fucking responsibility. Yeah. A lot. Now that you're Elden Lord, Dad, you gotta go into the Shadow Realm and uh, put Mikkel in time out, <clears throat> essentially. Okay, so before we do that, and I think there was a little foreshadowing in all of that, the whole Mikola on the back of, of people. Uh, I would like to just take this moment really quickly to shout out to two of our, our fans who are jamming right now the comment section, uh, Samuel and Ethan and uh, everybody else that's, that's, that's hitting the comments and, and watching. We really appreciate it. Thank you, as we Samuel go into, and Ethan. Into, but we're we Thank are but but the but the but the guys the guys that are that are hitting it on a regular basis we just want to give them a shout out and uh yeah. and we really appreciate your support and uh even if we're not there commenting and giving you thumbs up all the time uh we we do see it and we do we appreciate do. Yes. it so so keep it up guys and spread the word we're really trying to get this channel channel out there and yeah. uh and it's it's 
It's people like you that are going to make that possible. So we really, really appreciate each and every one of you. So thank you very much. We're most fortunate that you could join us on this grand adventure. Okay. Now, 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 NPC here. All right. So now, uh, or are we now still on Mikola? Are we still? Forward. No, I've already explained the situation. Okay, but I don't think we're done talking. Or... Yeah, talk to her again. Oh, okay. On, see if she has you... anything more to say. I will not be far behind. Okay, she's. Come now. I will not be far behind. Okay, she's done. Oh, yeah, so All now right. she's repeating dialogue. Okay. All right, so, so now, now do I shake uh, hands let, let, with this guy? Before, before we do that, let me explain to you what you're looking at here. Pan the camera up so we see the full uh, cocoon thing. Okay, so that withered arm, that is actually the physical withered corpse of Mikola in the physical plane. Dad, oh, one second. Sorry. I'm framing the shot. Oh, okay. I, I it's, uh, we're having some latency issues, so I thought. Okay, I there explaining. it is. There it is. Shot is framed. Okay, go ahead. Cool. Talk. All right. So, that arm. This is the. I'm such a this, dick. <laughs> this is the withered physical corpse of Mikola in the physical plane. So, the area where you fought Melania. Right. Originally, Mikola basically went into like an eternal sleep to grow the Helica tree, and he was feeding oh. his own blood to the Helica tree. Okay. Apparently, for some reason, this wasn't working out. So Mikola had a change of plans. He used his he used his charm to charm Moog, the 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 Blood Lord that you fought in this arena right here. He right. charmed him to essentially. He sent Melania to fight Radon while Melania was away. He then charmed Moog to come in, basically extract Mikola from the Halakatri. He. Halicatree cocoon and put Mikola inside this like blood cocoon. I don't know the exact technical specs. Leave a comment below if I'm off on this, by the way. But he needed to do it this way so he can access the Shadow Realm. Because the gate of the divinity or some shit is in the Shadow Realm and he wants to become a true god, not just a demigod. So before Back when it was just the base game, we thought Moog was just this dickhead who kidnapped Mikola. But it turns out Mikola was... This was part of his master plan all along. Alright, so go ahead and touch the withered arm of Mikola. Welcome to, to episode triple zero, where we didn't set up a new character, we just set up a new narrative. Okay, so let me guess. Mikola, Moog, and Radon have something to do with all of that's, that's going on here. Is that is that basically the gist that I'm getting? Actually, yes. Okay. Yeah. Cool. And I actually, I actually followed that. All right. Uh, well, Dad, keep in mind, I have told you multiple times that we have to defeat Moog and Radon to unlock the Shadow Realm. Yes, and, and you said that a lot of times, but you also said a lot of tarnished stuff before I knew what you meant there either. So I, I'm right. picking up, son. I'm, I'm getting right, there. Cool. I'm getting there. So, so, so since people want to see at least one of us playing, and I think that's going to be you most of the time, what, uh, where, what are we doing here, buddy? Where are we going? Uh, do we shake hands? And, yeah, just walk forward and touch the arm of Mick and just touch the, uh, touch the withered arm. Head to the realm of of, of shadow. Wow. D d does this is this supposed to like like is this a drum roll moment? Just press yes, Dad. Is there there's a cutscene, right? Uh, cut actually, scene? not really. It's, really? No. Nope. Because now you're there. Okay. You think they'd play a cutscene, but no. Just click the arm. Oh man! You're in the no, shadow realm like, now. Oh, fucking start over, shit! Oh, that sucks a hey, dog. Dad, do you see Look the little, at that. Dad's a little little pointy pillar icon in the in the upper right of the map. Yep. Place a beacon there. Okay. And follow that beacon. Oh, Jesus, it's beacon three. Are you kidding me? I've got my beacons in the other. All right. Well, I know we'll get to all of that. So can I can I get the horse here? Well, you have to exit first. Oh, cool. Never mind. You can. Here wow. it is. Wow. Wow. Okay. There it is. That's the, that's the panorama. Yep. That's the big one. The F dash dash word. 
Wow. Be the you power know what? Below if you got that reference. I love. I I just love. What well, I I love in a in a. Hey Dad, I'm gonna let you way. know. I know this is all whimsical and cool and all, but the late. Did you notice? I just I bad. just stopped because I knew I noticed that I ran past a thing a, a thing of grace. Did you notice that? I saw that. Okay, so. All right, so I'm because of what you've told me, I am being cautious here, and, okay. and anything that I anything that I come across, I'm not assuming that I can just destroy it like I can. I mean, if normal then, enemies come to fight you, then yeah, definitely fight them. You'll get a taste for the new scaling because it's different now in the Shadow Realm. You found the first map fragment. Go ahead and activate the map. I hit the wrong fucking button. I hit the. Whatever the button down in the middle is, and I was just a new map. Okay. Zoom All right. Out. So we're. Sorry, I it it's not going to help me if I can't see it. Well, that's too much out. So that's the first um, little chunk of the shadow realm. Right. So now we want to find. We want to. Are we are we eating our vegetables first, or what are we doing? Are we are we uh, we're gonna trying actually, to find sites of grace in here, or are we trying to find map fragments? Oh, I see. That's a shore, isn't it? So that's is, probably nothing Back, over here. Uh, go down. There's a little, uh, do you see? No, no, that little, little zoom in. Go back to where your character icon is. Okay. Now go left, up and left. See that little, little white circle to the left? Yep. That gray? Right here? Yeah, so uh, up there, there, just above there, you see a little box? Yep. Yep. We're gonna go there that's, first. That's okay. gonna be the. T that's gonna be our first spot. Little mini, little boss fight in the shadow realm. So this is where I'm gonna get my ass monstered. This is this is basically the first. When I when I played this for the first time, I I came across this first, and I fought my first boss. I thought pretty highly of myself, and then I got humbled. Yeah, and then I, I realized I, what I was in for. And I, I remember gamers, the story. Many gamers got very butt hurt when their end game I win builds were no longer winning very hard. Now they have to try and put in effort. But we already did that in the lands between. Now we got to put in more effort. It was a cool idea, and I still have mixed feelings about the scaling. But I understand it. It's it's it was set up for gameplay balance reasons. But FromSoft did get a lot of initial backlash for because you know so, put, you know putting putting many hours of gameplay into perfecting a build just to have it get shit on again feels bad. It just does. See, but I don't have that kind of connection to my build, so to me this is just this is just fun. It's just I'm gonna get my ass kicked, right? Is yeah, it? Just, do you just, want me to go through here, right? Yeah, you travel, want me to traverse? Yeah, yeah, that's where we're at. Yep. No, uh, okay, I. Well, why else would we be there? If you're going the wrong way, why? All right, all right, Robin. Back up and heal. Wait for an attack and then go for his blood. Shit. Yeah, welcome to the Shadow Realm scaling. He killed you in three hits in full Radon's arm. Welcome to the Shadow Realm. See, it doesn't piss me off. It's just like, oh, well, this is fun. Because it, it certainly it's been, rubbed it, me the wrong other way. Other than a boss fight, other than a boss fight, it's been a while since anything's Steak challenged me. And I don't, I don't mean that to be bragging. It's just the truth. I mean, I'm, I'm fighting dragons and beating them in, in, with seven swings. It's just, it's. At some point, that doesn't become fun. So going into, you know, and, and, and just monstering through more stuff, I just, that doesn't make any sense to me why that would be more fun than being challenged. Well, Dad, keep in mind, a lot of nerds are quite challenged enough in real life, and they're kind of looking for an escape to feel powerful. And it would Robin, be nice not to sound to like an after-school special, but we all have our challenges. I know. We all have our challenges. Everybody has their challenges. But, but, some, but, but some nerds... Tend to tend to kind of make their gaming part of their personality, and when their gaming skill is challenged, they feel like their personality is challenged, and eventually they just feel like losing equals you're less of a person. Or
Anyways. Not to distract you, I saw you were you're actually getting some big decent hits in that fight. Wait, this dude's got lifesteal. What a dick. I fucked that up. I tried to get a swing in before I backed off and he hit me. He doesn't have the wind up that I thought he did. Now, Dad, we can... St if we... Now, you can continue to fight this guy or we can collect a few scatter tree fragments to tilt the odds in our favor. I just wanted to introduce you to this boss fight to let you know the ride that we are in for. Now, that's fine. That, I'm going to give fine. you this I'm... option, Dad. Do you want to beat the boss with zero scatter tree fragments, or do you want to collect a few and then come back and fight him? I don't. I, I don't know what a scatter tree fragment is, buddy. It's what's going to. So, oh, oh yeah, I didn't explain the scatter tree fragment system. Okay, so you're while in the shadow realm, the scaling has changed. Right. However. There are items you can pick up in the game called Scatter Tree Fragments. Every Scatter Tree Fragment you pick up increases your offense and defensive capabilities within the Shadow Realm. So think of each Scatter Tree Fragment as 8% back to normal scaling. 5 to 8% back to normal scaling. Okay, no, I... I All okay, you need to know I, is click the Scatter Tree Fragments, it makes you more powerful in the Shadow they're Realm. They're power-ups. They're power-ups. Yes. They're power-ups. They're DLC power-ups. Power -ups. But specifically okay. for the Shadow Realm, they don't do anything for you in the base game. I, I understand. When I go back to the base game, I, I yeah, okay. it's back to it's back to crushing everything. You would be everything. surprised how many people think they should be a lot stronger by collecting these. They don't understand the the concept of balance and scaling. Uh, boys, girl, boys' room, girls' room. I understand. As you know, that's that they're they're two different places. You know, okay. it, it's like so the moon, Earth, whatever. I get it. Gravity's different. In both places. That's just look at it that way. All right, you so know? Dad, what's your decision? What would make the best narrative? Because you could also come All in right, with Steak me America, and we could just beat the shit out of this guy right now. Dad, Steak America, let's see if you can overcome the the mausoleum boss with zero scatter tree fragments. Well, do you do you do you wanna come in? Do you wanna come in and fight him with me?